All right, let's do this. Keep the ball moving here. Okay, Steam Deck fans, I got nothing for you. Nothing on a Monday. <laughs> I'm sitting here messing around here. I'm just joking. What's up, Steam Deck fans? Okay, Chris, what you got for these people? Talk! <laughs> Hello. Another beautiful day. Yeah. Hope your five senses work. Hope your health and strength is good. What? All right. What do we get? What do we got for you, Steam Deck fans? Steam Deck tribe, Steam Deck nation, Steam Deck universe, Steam Deck world, Steam Deck legion. What's up, Steam Deck mob? Yeah, what's good? And the Steam Deck squad. All right, look. I, I think I did this article before, but PCN Games got one up there, so I, let's redo it. Talking about here, uh, Steam Deck mod can boost FPS up to 24 and 25 percent in some games. Says here, uh, Creo Utility Steam Deck mod can increase performance of an handheld gaming PC in games like GTA and may help uh, pro uh, prolonging the life of its SSD. Says here, a Steam Deck mod promise to bolster the device ability to pump out even more frames per second. Per second while also improving the longevity of its portable powerhouse SSD. While this sounds too almost good to be true, these claims appear to mostly hold up, but there are some games and scenarios that may that may performance decrease based on their changes. And it says here, uh, the Creobyte utility uh, suit developed by Creobyte 33 can help boost FPS by up to 24% and 25%. With you, with the YouTuber offering deep dives into how the Steam Deck mod affects frame rates in games like Cyberpunk 2077 and GTA 5, it can be downloaded for free at GitHub, where you also find installation instruction. Without getting too technical, the Steam Deck mod ex essentially allows you to better tune the device to more e efficiently use the memory in its RAM, random access memory, and SS SSD solid state drive. To improve performance, should Creo, Creo uh, Utilities have you feeling skittish, <laughs> however, for whatever reason, you will be able to easily reverse any of the changes you made through its applications. And then it says here, just bear in mind that it's not an entirely flawless silver bullet of sort, and games like Red Dead Redemption 2 don't play so well with Creo Utilities, resulting in lower frame rates. Still, there's no reason not to try it. If you're feeling adventurous, when they said when they said uh, still there's no reason not f not to try it. If you're feeling adventurous, it's talking about uh, <laughs> you know for like if you, if you were in the, if you were in the trenches, if you were in the trenches back when when PC just got started with the 286, 386, 486 Pentium ones, Windows 3.1, um, Windows 95, 98 DOS for all those people that used to mess around with stuff in the early days of Linux, <laughs> then um, this this is for you. So the Steam Deck made game, made uh, made video games fun because one, you got a portable PC in your pocket and it is a portable PC. Take it on the go with you. You can play your games. You can, uh, you can make your own boot up screen and then you can adjust the settings to, uh, to whatever you like. So that's what the Steam Deck brought to the table. And uh, Valve, uh, Valve, uh, they said they said they said they weren't competing with PC. It's a part of the PC family, and what that meant, what that meant was, what it really meant when I read it, when I looked at it, it meant that they picked up. They basically they picked up where the Wii where the Wii U left off. They picked up right where the Wii U left off because you have the Steam Deck and a laptop. Where the Wii U has a um, a tablet and a console. You have a Steam Deck and a desktop. Where the Wii U has a tablet, tablet and a console. You have the Steam Deck and a desktop. So the Steam Deck is just picking up right where the Wii U left off. So the Steam Deck is that good, man. So yeah, you Steam Deck nerds have fun with this. Have fun with this. Uh, this utility, since y'all like to uh, mod stuff, build stuff, and all this, all all this other stuff. <laughs> you know, so enjoy, it, man. Um, but other than that, man. Um, you guys are loaded, as far as games is concerned. Um, you guys got six thousand plus more updates coming in, and yeah. 
Steam deck is loaded. Anyway, I'm going to leave this video for y'all to enjoy. Nice talking to you people again. Chris, still Star Wars and Star Trek thing. Or Dark Side. Oh. Peace.